I'm Mark Lynn. Here's our top story. The stock for outsourcing development of gaming consoles. This multi-billion dollar industry is expected to provide thousands of jobs in the country. Take a look at this report. This appears to be fun, but it actually is a lot of hard work. These are the pioneers of a new industry in India. They are testing console games for American companies. Computer-based games started with ordinary PC games and then moved on to mobile phone games. The ultimate in gaming is the console gaming. Worldwide, it is worth around $42 billion. India has now made an entrance into this high technology field. The first outsourcing for testing these console games has begun in Hyderabad. It is economically tested in India according to Activision Senior Vice President Brian Ward. Uh, we're operating in a resource constrained environment in America where we really can't find all the talent that we would like to have uh, developing and testing the games. And uh, with the high degree of technical proficiency and talent base here in India, it seems like a logical uh, place does, to explore. Does it work out to be much cheaper than doing it? Today? It works out to be cheaper. It's also a great opportunity for India, according to the CEO of the company, Prakash Abuja. The game industry in India, really speaking, is in the nascent stages as yet. It's emerging as a high growth industry. The last number I read about it, I think they said it's about $100 million in India. But we are focusing on the global market. Uh, the global market for the video gaming industry is about $42 billion. Uh, the gaming industry is a technology intensive industry and there is no provider from India which caters to that market. And you are the first? We are the first. Do you have enough manpower in India for that? Luckily India has got very abundant raw talent. So you think the youth of this country have a future in the sector like Absolutely. This? This, is, this is the only industry where I think you get paid to play. This center also produces animation games on its own for the Indian market. So a new opening for die-art game enthusiasts and animators in India. Sanjeev Thomas, Doodashin News, Hyderabad. So watching, Namaskar.